My name is Graeme Moore, I'm a consultant plastic surgeon and my area of special interest is skin cancer. We have been using electrochemotherapy uh, in this hospital for just over four years. Electrochemotherapy uh, can be used after all other previous treatments, whether that be surgery, radiotherapy or chemotherapy. Uh, and it's particularly effective following radiotherapy because you can really only use radiotherapy once uh, and it's usually the final treatment option and therefore uh, it's very useful to be able to have another treatment option that you can use after radiotherapy. The nice thing about electrochemotherapy is you, you can repeat it as often as you need to up to a point and uh, you, know, you can have two, three or even four treatments. In a case like melanoma or breast cancer where the patient has spent years going through all the other treatments uh, one by one, particularly surgery, then chemotherapy, then radiotherapy, um, really reached the end of the line in some patients. So it's wonderful that we now have a new treatment, electrochemotherapy, which can be used after all other treatments have been used. It's another line of, uh, of hope for the patient. More than half of it currently is in melanoma um, because we have a lot of patients who've reached the end stage of all other treatments and they have quite nasty um, wounds which need palliation. Um, and I think this is more powerful than a, a palliation tool, if you like. I think it's actually a, a, a good treatment in its own right, and I think that will, will, will be proven over the, the coming months and years. The standard treatments for breast cancer, obviously surgery uh, and chemotherapy and radiotherapy. Um, electrochemotherapy, in the first instance, I think, will be used for... Uh, patients who've, uh, where other treatments have been exhausted, traditional treatments have been exhausted, and then electrochemotherapy is the only available alternative. Patients on the whole are um, very appreciative of the fact that the treatment has worked. So if patients have nasty wounds, they affect patients' lifestyles. They can be painful, they can bleed, they can exude uh, fluid and require lots of dressings, and uh, they can be smelly and uh, uh, ECT is highly effective at, uh, at reducing all of those symptoms, if you like. As we get more experience with this treatment, and as the evidence uh, increases, uh, we're using it more and more. Um, certainly, uh, it's very valuable in end-stage uh, melanoma, where all other treatments have been used. Uh, you can control really um, nasty, unpleasant tumours, and uh, in some cases, completely obliterate them. The future for electrochemotherapy um, is going to be quite exciting because I think it's going to be used in more and more surgical specialties such as breast, gynaecology, head and neck as, as well as uh, treating skin cancer. But slowly I think we're showing uh, that this is a very valuable addition to the armamentarium uh, against, uh, uh, against cancer.